One day, Peppa Pig and George were playing outside, when Peppa had an idea. She was tired of playing in their yard, so Peppa said to George, Why don't we build a spaceship? And George said, Peppa, we can't build a spaceship. We're just little children pigs. And Peppa says, I'll be right back. When Peppa returned, she was wearing a, a spaceship suit. And she says, now we're ready, George. But George still didn't know how she was going to build a space shuttle. The next time George looked over, Peppa had built a rocket ship. And she was ready to go into outer space with George. She said, George, are you ready? And he was. So Peppa went in the driver's seat and then George, well, he was up top. And you know what? They were ready for liftoff. So Peppa said, three, two, one, fire thrusters. And off they went into outer space. So off into space they went, Peppa and George, traveling nearly the speed of light. But then they heard something. Peppa didn't know what it was. Something was getting close to them. What could be getting so close to them? She didn't know. But it was a spaceship that was getting close. Coming in. Super fast. But you know who it was? It was none other than Mickey Mouse. Mickey had come in to see what they were doing. And Mickey was super excited to see Peppa and George as they traveled on the spaceship. Mickey told Peppa that she needs to stop on the nearest planet. And then that way they could hang out and, and talk. And Peppa thought that was a good idea. So she followed Mickey to the planet. So they landed on the planet of You Betcha. They didn't know why it was called You Betcha, but Mickey Mouse said, it's because that's what I want to name it, You Betcha. So they all decided to get out of their spaceships. So while on the planet of You Betcha, they heard a funny sound, and they didn't know what it was, but then they saw and it looked like a bad guy coming. And at first, Peppa was scared. But Mickey Mouse said, this is a You Betchian. He lives on the planet You Betcha. He's not mean at all. He just... Well, they just got really big mouths. And he just is coming to say hi. So the Ubechian was such a nice helper that he picked George up so George could see all the way around the planet. That was so nice of him. But then, when it was time for the Ubechian to go home, they realized that they were all tired. And that George, Peppa, and Mickey, well, they didn't have a bed. Since it's outer space, you're just going to take some blue Play-Doh we're just going to make some little beds for Peppa and George. Just like in Mickey Mouse, of course. So like that and like that. Because they're in outer space. They can't have real fancy beds. And they knew that, so that's why they made these nice, easy Play-Doh beds. Because even if you're in outer space, you've got to be able to sleep. So here are their beds. They look just like little cots. Nothing fancy because, again, they're in outer space. But you know what they need now? Even though they're in outer space, they're going to need blankets. So we made a silver Play-Doh blanket for Peppa and George. And we'll make one more for Mickey Mouse. So Mickey doesn't get cold. Because even if you're exploring space, you don't want to get cold at night. So these look more like instead of beds, like sleeping bags. So the next morning, Mickey Mouse and Peppa and George woke up and they were totally ready to go. Where do you think they should fly to next? Should they go to Mars, the moon, or some other planet? Leave us a comment and let us know where they should fly to as super special astronauts. Bye, everyone. Hi, everyone. Take a look at some of these other Peppa Pig videos, like the Peppa Pig eating ice cream in the ice cream eating contest, or Peppa Pig jumping in mud puddles. There's even one with Peppa Pig sharing a bicycle with her friend, Susie Sheep. 
I hope that you like Peppa Pig and you like some of these other videos. Just to find the one that you like and click on it and you'll find it a new video page that you can watch. Take care and enjoy and have lots of fun.